Welcome to the first episode of Life and Death. This is Siddharth from ISA and here we have with us Divya. Hi Divya. Hello. How's the morning been? It's good. It's sunny today so it's nice. So uh, the whole part of me doing this is because we want to share your experiences with the incoming students so that they feel like I know there is a lot of tension which goes on but then they don't need to panic. So we would like to keep it all through your perspective and how did how was your experience from which started from by being back back at home and then you coming all the way till here. So the first question is uh, what was your overall experience with the housing portal of Tudor? It was little overwhelming in the beginning because uh, we don't get a lot of information but I think uh, once you pay your fees in time and the portal opens it's just taking one step at a time but I do advise people to avail this service because it becomes extremely difficult to come here and find accommodation. When did you pay your fees and what is your opinion on paying the fees? Should it be quick, should they be lazy or should they be like you know taking their time in that? No but I think because of the housing it's preferable that you pay early. I paid in the last week of March and that's why I could get an accommodation that I really wanted because I know a lot of people who couldn't. So I suggest if you're really sure about this then don't take any more time and just pay it as soon as you get the uh, like if your application gets through yeah that's nice uh how do you manage your food uh this is not the first time that i'm living by myself so uh, i know how to cook i can manage but i know that's not going to be the case for a lot of people so i advise that at least you get little familiar with cooking before coming here but uh most of the things you want you get here in uh, supermarkets and also we have another shop that gives you Indian ingredients, so it shouldn't be that difficult for you to manage. Yeah, and also, nice. eating out is expensive, so that's why I insist again that you familiarize yourself a little bit with cooking before coming here. I can actually so relate with you because before coming here, I never used to cook, but after coming here, I think I just learned cooking all by myself. Just use online resources or call your mom. Yeah, yeah. You have all the ingredients over here and you are still good to go I think yeah like which is nice but I think sometimes it gets so overwhelming that you come here then you have to learn Uh, so it's nicer if you can at least it's better to come prepared yeah a little bit like the basic things at least yeah so how do you balance uh, between academic and uh, social activities I think that's one good thing that we can uh, I mean we can learn from here I think because the Dutch way of learning is like of working is very efficient so you work through the weekdays and then weekend is for you. So that's when you socialize, that's when you hang out, that's when you plan these small trips. So it's nice, there's a good balance. That's and I think the faculty nice. also encourages you to have that balance, so it's good. That's nice, that's nice. So how are you coping up with the weather? Um, not great, but I also I'm from the south of India, so I usually, we have so many sunny days and most of them are warm. Here you don't find that. There will be a lot of gloomy days, so that is very difficult. Uh, but I think the, I think one advice that I would give is whenever you're feeling low, you make an attempt, you go out, you hang out with your friends, you keep your circle close. And I think also uh, maybe get your vitamins checked before coming here, because I think we will face an issue with vitamin D levels. Personally, as, uh, I felt I faced that. So I think just get all your meds in place and I think it's fine. It'll take you a bit, it'll take you a while to adjust. At least last year was difficult for me, so I'm hoping this year would not be because I've already experienced that once. That's nice. So, one thing you don't like? Yeah, the weather. And also the food, because it's quite bland. Like, the Dutch food is quite bland. So, so if yeah. you are foodie, better come yeah, prepared. Yeah, better come prepared. Yeah, That's definitely. Nice definitely. definitely. So, coming to the last question, one advice for the new batch? Uh, relax. Breathe. It's fine. I know it's very scary, but we've all done it and we are here and I think we are all happy. We are all satisfied with where we are today. So I think just take one step at a time, write things down and then strike them off. And I think just trust the process. And I think once you're here, you'll have a very strong community. So it will not be that difficult. Yeah, I yeah. understand. Like there's so many Indians all over here like everywhere so exactly. it's, it, it's you never feel that lonely. Yeah, we have a very huge and very strong community. So I don't think you'll ever feel that difficult yeah, so you'll feel at home yeah yes that's nice so this is your so that's signing off thank you Divya so much for your time no problem. Thank i you. hope you have an amazing time more further yes. all the best for your thank you